I am the man, and the man wants to talk to you about my involvement in drumming. Um, when I was in school, um, I went out for the drums to practice on so I can get good. Uh, my teacher at the time said to me I, I would not make it. Um, and I'm trying as uh, hard as I can to follow his instructions. And, I, you know, like I had this black thing and I had to go like, like that. And then he got angry at me for no apparent reason. And, and says, kid, um, you're not following. I go, sir. I'm trying the hard as I can. And he was like downright rude. And also, um, he took my block away and the, and the drumstick and says, your lesson is over. Uh, you can go back to your class. And then he called me, a, he called me a loser. And he also called me an idiot. I forgot the guy's name, but um, that there was certain ways you can hold a. Excuse me. There's a certain way you can hold your drumsticks. Um, for me, I learned. Um, you can do it like this. Right here you go, like the, the you know, uh, like, like this. And then I learned the flip of the uh, of the sticks. I'm gonna use one though uh, for that. I would do it two ways. First this way. See, put that right there. Or, and there's a band. There is a band called Sweet back in the 1970s. His name is, let's see, Mick. I don't know his, I don't know his last name, but there's a song called Ballroom Blitz. And it, um, Brian Connolly comes out first. I will show a link, I will show you the link to that song. And <clears throat> he, he, he will come out first and says, uh, um, let's see, ready Andy, ready Steve, but each person will say, uh-huh, yeah, so it'd be like, so let's say I am Brian Connolly, and I'll do each part, he will come up to the stage and says, ready Steve, uh-huh, Andy, uh-huh, uh, uh -huh. And then Mick says, yeah. So the, 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 the song, uh, the song plays, and it's, and the drummer, Mick, he, he has it like down here. So he's doing this. When he's doing the song, he takes, uh, I think, I'm not going to do it with, with this hand because it's hard for me to do. I am a right-handed person. Uh, and he, when he's doing, like, doing that song, he'll be, be doing, like, uh, uh, this may fall, but he, he'll be doing it, and then he's doing this each time. And then he did a, another song called Teenage, uh, let's see, um, Black Buster, S same way. Like this thing, when he, and he's doing, like, when he's, when he's doing this and stuff. In in mid song, he be doing let's see yeah, I just wrapped it, so I am trying to go fast. That's what he used to do. He used to do it uh, very very quickly. Like he'd be like he's doing this then he's going
There's a certain way you can do it. Me, I, I learned that from my teacher. Now that's why I know how to, because like, you can do it this way by doing the flip easier. See? And then, and then, then you hold it, which I said, down to here, go here and go. Like that. And then, that. Oh, there you go. That's how uh, drummers do their, do their songs. Because they do it, um, they do it so quickly. Like, um, there's one song I was listening to on YouTube, and uh, I forgot what the song was. Oh, I know what. It was, um, let's see, it, by, it was by Guns N' Roses, and, it, and the song title was called Welcome to the Jungle. Um, I forgot the guy's name. I think, it, no, he's a guitarist, but the, but the drummer, he's doing this fast, and, he, and then he's doing, like, and then he, ah, sorry guys, hold on. He's doing like, like this, you know, like, I'm trying to not, um, do it what he does. He's, hold on, you know what, ah, do it like this. There you go. Like this. He's doing this and he's playing at the same time. And to me, that's hard to do. I, I hope you understand what I went through with that teacher who called me um, a, he also called me a punk because I'm trying to follow what he, he was doing and he says, you're listening this over. I'm like, I just looked at him and go, thank you for your time. And he goes, go back to, go back to, go back to your class. So I went back. So there'll be two links into the description today. One on that guy named Mick from the band Sweet. And, and the song will be Ballroom Blitz. And the other one, by the, by the same band, it, it will be Blockbuster. Because, we, which like I said, when he's doing this over here with his hand, and he's doing this too. But the way that, that he, the way that he's doing it is like on the tips of, the tips of his fingers. I can't do that. I can only do it like this. So, uh, if you want me to uh, teach you f um, any more uh, drum pattern, drum patterns, or anything else, favorite, like, share, and subscribe. I am the man. And the man says, turn on your like button <coughs> and smash the sweet like button and make that over. 97 times. That's the year, the year that Brian Connolly passed away in 1997. Um, and I will post their channel as well. Um, there's a guy named Andy. He's still living. Uh, there's only three guys living. I think. I'm not quite sure because the the two no two are living and two and two passed. The 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 drummer passed, and the lead singer, Brian Connolly. I enjoy this band Sweets because they have awesome songs. I can name three songs, or uh, four songs that I love. Ballroom Blitz, Blockbuster, Teenage, uh, Teenage Rampage, and my other song, and that would be Action. Very awesome songs. So, anyways, there will be a vlog later. Hold on a sec. Okay. Um, 
if I am back on time, which I said, I'm doing something with a family member, I'm not going to say his name, I'll call him the dude. So, the dude, me, and my cousin, the other wolf, are going to see, um, um, the new movie on the Lion King. Um, and then go out afterwards. Uh, I'm not allowed to say this part, but he's going somewhere. Um, far away in Texas. That's what I can only only tell you tell you for right now. It's something something to do with hockey. I'm not gonna say what he does because it's not important to you because you don't know who I'm talking about. That's why I named him the dude. So you know, so that dude would not would not be here tomorrow. And which like I said, I could be going to Texas, but I would try to go on a airplane if if I can. So. I'll see you guys later. Um, I wish I can put, um, I don't have a CD on this band suite, but I, I wish I said three links. Let's see. Uh, Blockbuster, which I said, Bottle, Bottle and Blitz, and their YouTube channel. Play, and I want you to subscribe to them. This means a lot to me. Because number one, they did songs from the from the nineteen seventies and from nineteen seventy five, the year I was born in. And it comes to my hold on a minute. All right, um, Peter. Um, I I have to cut this short, uh, because Peter MacArthur uh, gave me a message, so I will up I will upload this. Um, after I read his message, and, uh, well, I, I'm gonna upload it now, and then I can read his message. Sorry about that. So, I'll see you guys later. Uh, don't forget, new videos up all, all month, and, um, for that, from the hockey news. And I, I do have some hockey news, but I will, uh, tell you in a, in a different video this week. Uh, I forgot what to say, so I'll see you guys later.